everyone, hope you're well. So I'm gonna do an Aldi grocery haul. Uh, we actually came off holiday on Friday, today's Monday, so it's kind of a little bit of stock up. But I didn't actually spend that much, then 86 pounds, which isn't too bad. Um, it's a lot of like school stuff, you know, when the kids are back to school, I'm doing pet lunches um, and they got snacks and you know what I mean? It's really hard to know what to do for meals. This weather's been really, really nice and I just wanna use the barbecue and we do a lot of our own meat, obviously. So I just got a couple of bits. Um, so yeah, I spent 86 pounds and I'll show you what we got. Okay, so so over here, I got Miles some nappies, size six. Um, so we've been using the size six pull-ups, but um, they're absolutely fine. But sometimes they kind of chafe him around the like leg area, the pull-up style. I don't know why. I don't know if it's just the way they fit on him. So I thought I would go back to the normal nappy so we'll see how these go. I still got the size six, which I know are gonna be quite roomy, but it should be fine. Um, I got dent sticks for our old dog Pickles. He's got the worst breath ever, and he is so old he can't chew the these or Bonios. They're just too hard for him. So these are the good ones for him. They're minty and they're about 59p a pack. And the two other dogs have Bonios, and then I got them the Mega Chew as well as a little treat. Um, dip it, cheese dip and crackers. I just thought that would be a good thing to put in the kids' pack lunches. I'm trying to just switch up some things. Chicken poppers, Violet had these and Alice had these on holiday and they seem to like them. So again, I could potentially put them in a lunch box or they have after school snack or weekend snack. Sausage rolls, again, for lunches. And then I've got two lots of the chicken breast slices, which me and Graham actually really like and the kids like as well. So um, they're just handy for midweek lunches. And then some honey roast ham. I've got some ice creams. I saw these. They're basically like ice cream Mars bars. So I've got those. And then also screwballs. The kids love those. And then Violet's desperately kept requesting a lolly. Um, so I bought the rocket lollies because I am partial to one of those as well. Uh, some frozen vegetable medley. I love this. It's just so quick. It's got the, um, the cauliflower, the broccoli, the like round carrots and the peas, it's just so convenient just for if you've run out of every veg. Um, I did get some two-in-one um, washing gel. I've used this before. It's really, really nice, the lavender and chamomile, but I also got the pods as well. Um, again, that's a three-in-one. And then we've got the mini corn on the cobs. I used these a couple of weeks ago, and honestly, no one could tell the difference that they were frozen. They were really, really nice. So I got those again. They're about 99p for a pack. I don't know how many's in there. I'm um, not sure. Um, and then they've got this sort of stuff out at the moment down the special dial. So I got the smoky barbecue tacos. And then these are the hard shells. And then I also got the soft shells as well, the dinner kits. Obviously there is five of us and we just, one pack's just not really enough. Um, especially if you get the soft taco shells because that's only eight in there. And also, if there's any left over, you can always put them towards other things like lunches and whatever. Stuff them with other things. Right, so I've got some deliciously, golden delicious apples, which are my absolute favourite at the moment. And then mini bananas. I've got some tender stem broccoli. I've already got a head of broccoli in the fridge. I've got some celery, cucumber, some mixed peppers, avocado, two lots of wonky blueberries. Me and Miles have been eating blueberries so much recently. Pomegranate seeds, haven't had those in a while. And then I've got some raspberries and some strawberries. Just really into berries at the moment. I do have some in my freezer, so if I run out, I think I just need to defrost those. Um, I did get the salmon fillets with ginger and chili and lime. They're so good. And then we had these on holiday. The kids actually really like these as well. Um, so I got two lots of the Hunter's Chicken. It's just a really quick meal. Add some new potatoes or sweet potato fries and some veg, and it's simple. Um, these breaded goujons, I'm actually gonna have this for lunch. I'm gonna do myself like a chicken Caesar salad, um, probably with Miles and there, cause they were 30% off. And then I've got another pack as well. I might either have those for lunch or might just stick them in the freezer cause the kids like those. Some romaine lettuce, some Italian style lettuce, baby cucumber, baby plums, some miniature potatoes. I love these ones. Um, and then some cheese sticks, seafood sticks for the boys, and then mozzarella, pots of choc. Again, these are for Alistair and Graham. 
prawn cocktail graham for a lunch she loves that and then i've got some hummus some black olives me and violet love these some greek style yogurt i really haven't been eating yogurt at all recently but you know you just fancy like just some natural yogurt so yeah i just thought i'd get that and hopefully miles will have that because i think i've said before the kids really don't eat yogurt anymore um unless it's like alistair will eat something like that but actual like natural yogurt they're just not interested so hopefully miles might have some of that with some fruit i got some onion and garlic sort of base sauce so it's just for anything really bolognese lasagna a pasta sauce whatever two lots of the coconut milk just handy really handy to have and then two lots of the coconut rice i don't actually think we need it but i thought as a backup it's always good to have some extras um i got these it, this was in the specials a five pack of the quinoa lentil and hummus chips I've had these before, they're really, really nice. And then also I got some Bakewell Tart Raw Bars. These are like the Naked Bars. Um, and then I got the kids, the Jammy Wheelie Minis, and then the Wafer Bars, the Wacko Bars. Again, these are good for packed lunches. Miles, so they had these on offer, 125 I think. So I thought I would try him with those. And some Fruit Wigglers. Um, yogurt raisins, he's already dug into those. I really like those as well, to be honest. Um, veggie straws, he loves those. Baking paper, needed that. Croissants, milk rolls, everyone loves these, having them in the morning with their breakfast. Garlic slices, mini breadsticks. Miles loves breadsticks as well, and I got some normal ones with hummus. Um, again, this, just, this sort of stuff is really handy to take out when we go out for like the day. Um, Craze some frosted shreddies and some Weetabix for cereal some cheese bakes and some ready salted hoops so yeah that is my grocery haul for this week obviously we will get our fruit and veggie stuff on a wednesday so i didn't buy too much veg to be fair and i did actually go to the range because i needed to get some clear varnish for our bench so i got that but I also picked up, these are in the frozen section. We had stuff like this. I got from Aldi at Christmas time, mini chocolate eclair. So I got two lots of those and they were delicious. And if you like slightly thaw them out, they're like ice cream eclairs, amazing. And then I also got these garlic mushrooms. Don't know why, I just fancy those. And then some sweet potato fries, which is what I forgot to pick up in Aldi. I am just gonna add on a Costco haul. So I haven't been to Costco since October last year and I was kind of in the area and I thought, right, I'm gonna drop in. Um, we're still paying the membership, you pay like a yearly membership. And um, I had a quick look. I don't feel like I had a really good look just because I had Miles with me and he was very like irritable. He's just very tired, sat in the trolley. Um, so um, yeah, I'll show you what I got anyway. And Graham's gonna be so happy with me. Um, because I found these. This was uh, 24 cans of Pepsi Max for £6.49. So he's going to be really tough with those. Um, I got the bottle Zulu bottles for Miles. Um, his, most of his water bottles, honestly, they leak like crazy. So I'm hoping, it says they're leak proof. We've had some similar ones like these before over the years with the other two. So I'm hoping these are going to do the job. These were £13 for three. Um, and they did have the adult Contigo ones as well, which I'm tempted to maybe get next time. But they do them in lots of different colours. And the adult ones are obviously like bigger. I got a rotisserie chicken because I always buy a rotisserie chicken. Uh, these are £4. And then I also spotted the Thai chicken satay and peanut sauce. Uh, so these are 20 skewers. I think these were $7.99. They are in the freezer section. I got these mega strawberry pencils. So this was £5.49 or four, I think it was actually £4.49. I actually got these to put away for Alistair's birthday. I'm struggling so much at the moment to just know what to get him. But he loves these like um, sweet 
things, these sweet pencil things. Um, and I just thought that would, he would not guess when that's wrapped up, he would not guess that this is a massive pack of these. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put that away for his birthday. Um, I got some head and shoulders because the boys are literally running out of this and it lasts forever in these pumps. Um, I think this is $12.99 for the pack of two. I got some tender stem broccoli because I'm just loving this at the moment and it's, it's actually quite a good deal. Like some things are a good deal and then some things are just not a good deal. You just, you know, Angel, you just know. But this was actually, I think it was $2.99 and obviously you can see it's a massive 480 gram pack. Um, I got some pineapple, uh, sweet and juicy. This was £3.49 for already like pre-done. First time buying sushi in Costco. Honestly, I've seen it there for years and years and I've never ever bought it. But um, I don't know, I just fancied it and I think we'll probably pick this for dinner tonight. Do a little bit of rotisserie and sushi. And then I bought 24 pack of veggie straws. So these two were actually 5 99 a box and the kids, the bigger kids were eating them as well. I also picked up these maple glazed pork loin steaks. These were 11 pounds. Oh my God, I just, they had so much like glazed stuff, like sweet chili thighs like in big packs for like barbecues and stuff. I will probably go back and buy some more later on, especially the sweet chili thighs. But these just took my fancy. It's barbecue weather this week. Yeah, I just couldn't help but getting these. Um, I got this rug for Alistair. His rug at the moment that he's got, he's had for a good few years and it's so, oh, it's just so like hard. So this is so soft. Um, they do this in like a oatmeal color as well, but this is like the speckled gray. Um, I think it was 15 pounds and it's quite a decent size actually. So I got him that and that is pretty much it. Apart from one impulse buy, so I wasn't gonna get this. It was either this though or a giant inflatable dinosaur um paddling pool and i just thought we didn't need that really but i spotted this and i was eyeing these up on amazon this one was 35 pounds which is pretty much half the price of the ones that i was looking at on amazon it's a water table for miles and i think it, he would just love it he will grow with it and you could use sand in it as well and it was 35 pounds um looks like that Right, quickly show you our Wednesday fruit and veggie box as well. This is kind of like top up stuff. Graham gets this lot from the farmer's market, this lot from our local greengrocer. So we've got, this is the fruit box. So we've got those grapes, plums, nectarines, love those. bananas, oranges, pears, uh, a couple of apples in there as well. And then over here we've got some strawberries, raspberries, we've got some mushrooms, we've got some onions, Big potatoes, broccoli, um, it's like a green cabbage thingy, some kale over there, some topped carrots, my, um, not my was, um, Peter Rabbit loves the tops, he loves carrots anyway. Um, baby spinach, we've got some plum tomatoes, cucumber, some oranges in there, pears and some gem lettuce. So yeah, that is all of fruit and veggie stuff for this week. So that is my Aldi, Costco and farmer's market grocery haul for this week. Whew, there's a lot of food there, but it does last and um, we do get through it, it's surprising. And none of it goes to waste because if it does go bad, it will go to the pigs or the rabbits, eats a lot of the greens as well. So um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have and I will see you in my next one.